the Atheist Experience blog for today uh, pointed me in the, the direction of something that's happening on Twitter, which is this uh, trend of uh, theists going on and proclaiming without God, and then saying what they feel that they or the world would be like without God. Uh, as you can see here, it's pretty much all negative. Um, I'll put a link on the sidebar. They actually do a good write-up about this portion, which I don't want to get into. Um, what I do want to get into is uh, I spent a good portion of today uh, on Twitter posting without God and then my views on it as an atheist. Um, a lot of atheists actually did that today. And um, one thing kept coming up over and over and over again, and it's this this uh, retweet of, I don't know who started this, but you can see there's just a bunch of people who retweeted it. And it reads, Without God, our week is Morn Day, Tears Day, Waste Day, Thirst Day, Fight Day, Shatter Day, and Sin Day. The implication being that if you don't have God, all of these horrible things are going to happen every day. Now, I... I wonder how many of these theists have actually thought about what they're saying. I mean, let's think about this. Without God, and this is what I always reply back to them, without God, the week names are exactly the same. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. The reason being, none of them refer to the Christian God. Um, if, if they took five seconds to go to Google and look for origins of the name for the days, I mean, that's what I put in, you, you see there's tons of, of, of uh, hits here, but the top one is just perfect. It points out that Sunday is literally the sun's day. Uh, Monday is the moon's day. Tuesday is for Tyr, which in the Roman uh, mythos is Mars, so that's basically the god of war. Wednesday is for Odin. Thursday is Thor. Friday is for Frigg, or Frigga. Take your pick. And Saturday is for Saturn going back to the Romans. Uh, what this means is, or, or where I go with this is, exactly what god are we supposed to be without? Because these names aren't pointing to the Christian god, they're pointing to the to the Norse and Roman gods. Should we be worshipping them to make sure that they aren't waste day and morn day and thirst day? Seriously. And if they think that that this is not a credible you know, source, it's in their dictionary. Here's Merriam-Webster, uh, Old English Sun Day, uh, Moon Day for, for Monday. Uh, here I've got it highlighted, Deity, but that comes back from Tuesday for Two and Day, and the more Deity, and the Deity tells you that Two is actually referring to, you know, the God of War, which would be Tyr. Uh, Wednesday, Wo Odin's Day, Thursday, Thor, Friday, Frigg or Frigga, depending, and Saturday going right back to Saturn. So, I mean, even if they don't have the internet, they can pick up their dictionary and look up this stuff. Do they think before they post this? I mean, really, is is this supposed to be... Is this supposed to, to convince anyone other than people who don't... don't know the basics of where the names of the days come from? <laughs>